Hey everyone, Wayne here from Zenata Consulting. In this tip, I've got a quick one on how to log an activity or task directly from a call within the CRM using the CRM dialer feature. Before I jump in though, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button and let's dive in. Okay, so to get started, let's go ahead and set up a call. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on my record here inside the leads module. Just like you would call anyone, you can simply just click on the phone and the call. Now I'm not gonna cover this in this video, how to set up your telephony, but this is assuming your telephony is already set up. So let's go ahead and hit the call. You can go ahead and see the call went through to myself and we'll make a note. Lead isn't interested. Hung up before I could tell him about the huge promo. Sometimes you might just hit done here, but the, the tip I want to actually share is you can actually set up a follow-up action directly from this module. So as you're going through your calls, it'll pre-populate everything and associate it to the record in this case myself. So if I wanted to pre-schedule a call, I can simply hit the add a follow-up action to schedule a follow-up call, which we don't want to do because I wasn't interested. You can also, let's say if you had an event that you wanted to add yourself to with them, you could go ahead and do that here and schedule an event, or you can go ahead and create a task, which is what I'll, I'll go ahead and walk through in this demonstration. So I can go ahead and say, um, email them. And we want this to go out, um, let's say Wednesday, right before Thanksgiving is it's gonna be a black Friday sale. If they want to learn about or should hear about, I should say. So let's say priorities high, you know, the regular settings owners might going to be myself, the admin user we will go ahead and set a reminder for myself the morning of. And then, uh, if you wanted to, you can go ahead and, you know, relate it to an account or do a status, uh, at currency or a description. So we'll go ahead and hit done and let's go ahead and save this. So normally when you have a call, if you're in hit done, you'd go ahead and see it in the closed activities, but nothing's populating yet. So let's go ahead and hit done. And now let's go ahead and refresh this view. So we go to closed activities, the call didn't go through. What we can see now is that under closed activities, the description of what we just logged down here is going to show up without outbound call. And then the activity we just created is also going to show up and it's going to be associated to this record. So like I said, pretty short and easy tip. I hope you found this tip useful. If you did, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. It really helps your channel grow. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments section below. We'll do our best to answer them on the next episode of Mazaz or visit club.zanata.com and drop your questions there. Until next time, have a great day.